Hello Cancers and welcome back to my channel Lumen Moon Tarot. So Cancers I am here um, to do your reading but today I'd like to give you guys a five day forecast right. Um, see how this week is going to go for you okay. And I'm being led to use my diary deck. Uh, for those of you who are new here this is a work in progress okay. Um, these are all memories from my personal life that hold great meaning okay and um, honestly right now I only share it with my cancer soul tribe this is too many though divine um, yeah I only share these with my cancer soul tribe because I trust you guys with my memories um, so anyway maybe you can apply this in your own life right so cancer yeah this is gonna be your five-day forecast this reading is for the collective, so it may or may not resonate with you. Just take what does resonate, Cancer. Toss out the rest, right? Don't try to force anything. And thank you so much, everyone. I love you guys. I love my Cancer Soul Tribe. Um, thank you so much for all of your support. I truly mean that. All the, all the likes, all of my subscribers. Thank you for everybody who sends me positive vibes. Just thank you for everything, Cancer. I love you. All right, Pizza Jag. Okay. Um, cancer, what I'm getting here, I've got the dollar store woman. I've got jumping out the window. And I've got the shimmering trees with Pizza Jag. Okay. <laughs> Um, what I'm feeling like here is you're going to be presented with an opportunity to help somebody, okay? The thing is, is you've got to make a, a decision, and it's going to be, a, it could be a tricky one, um, between helping somebody who may really, really need it and escaping the situation, okay, and saving yourself. So it's either saving someone else or saving yourself cancer you're gonna be faced with a decision to make I feel somebody is gonna to come towards you this week that's gonna really need your help it could be financially right because um, this is about money right my father he'd send me like a couple hundred dollars once in a while and on the check he would write pizza jag and that was our little thing together to let me know that I could spend it however I wanted. It was a it was a gift. It was a treat. And I feel like somebody's coming towards you that may want money, okay, or may need some financial help. They may even straight up ask you for two hundred bucks, because that's what my father always sent me, okay. Um, but yeah, you're gonna have to. Use your discernment here, Cancer, because I feel like um, this is using your discernment, right? You're going to get messages, red flags, some kind of sign. Be fully aware of your environment when this person approaches you for help. I feel like it could be financial help, but this was the kind of help that my father would send to me just as a treat. So this person could maybe say that they need help, but they, don't, they just want to take your money. Okay, so you're going to be faced with, should I help this person or should I escape this, you know, with, with my life, right? <laughs> Jumping out the window. Um, yeah, so uh, that's something that you're going to have to use your discernment. Yeah, and this is going to be something that's going to happen really suddenly, okay? It's going to seem weird. Like, you, maybe this is somebody that you haven't seen for a long time, and they're going to, like, come in blurting out a bunch of stuff and asking for something, okay? They're going to be asking you for some kind of help, and I feel like it's financial help, okay? Um yeah you're gonna have to make that choice this is kind of like I'm seeing this as a test of your discernment here what should you do see because cancers this is a real good test for you cancer how how much have you learned right how much have you grown see before if this person would have come towards you it, it's gonna feel like it's an emergency but I don't think it is okay it, pizza is not an emergency cancer, okay? Pizza money is not an emergency. It's not emergency money. But this person's going to make it 
really feel like it is look and the burning right they this is to burn you this is so that they can take advantage of you all right they may even say well you've done it before why can't you do it now they're going to play on how you were in the past okay but i'm telling you this is something that um is really going to burn you the fire ants yeah my calling or my job you're going to have to make a really important decision here you're going to have to make it you're going to have to make a very important decision on the fly very quickly um for yourself okay use your discernment cancer because seriously what like it would be a scenario like this um somebody comes back into your life whether it's a friend or an ex or a family member that you haven't seen for a long time and they're like all kinds of anxious hey i really need your help right they make it sound like a like it's so important like it's a life or death situation but really they just want your money they just want your money and you're going to have to be like okay should i help this person or should i escape the situation because this could be something that is really going to burn my butt, right? And it's going to be the end. I feel like there's going to be something here that tips you off, that like tips you off, T-I-P-S, right? Um, that um, is going to show you the red flags about this person. Like, I feel like you're just going to be, you're just going to know. You're just going to know deep down inside that this person is, is trying to take advantage of you. And at that point, I feel like that's it. That's just going to be it. You're not going to deal with this person after that. You're going to be able to break free from this person and let them go. Um, because the, you're not the same way you were before. You're not. This person thinks that they can take advantage of you, Cancer, and they're not going to be able to. All right, I see this happening this week. Um, yeah, to somebody in the next five days, you're going to know something's off, okay? Give me one more here for Cancer, and then I'll jump into Tarot and see what else is going on around you in the next five days. But yeah, this could even be an ex coming back knowing that you're abundant. Thinking they can play on that beautiful, nurturing, giving, um, trusting energy, right? But you've changed. You've changed, Cancer. And I don't think this person is realizing it, but I feel like, yeah, you're going to let them have it, Tiger. <laughs> I was just about to say that, too. You're going to let them have it. You're going to tell them the truth. You're going to, I feel like you guys are... Um, you're gonna, you're kind of, you're gonna see through this. You are. The divine's gonna help you out here. You're gonna see through it, and that's gonna be enough. Enough is enough, and you're gonna, you're gonna show them a side of you that they probably doesn't, they don't even know exists. Yeah, because you're a fighter now. Yep, because you're a fighter. Yeah, you're going to let the, yeah, I feel like you guys are going to deny this person, okay? And I feel like the divine is helping you with that. I feel like you're absolutely right in doing that. This is definitely somebody who's just trying to use you and take advantage of you, Cancer. In the next five days, okay? <clears throat> All right, what else can you show me for Cancer? What else can you show me for Cancer? Cancer energy the next five days. See, yeah, they're gonna be they're gonna be thinking that oh, Cancer, Cancer's a pushover. Cancer's a doormat. Cancer, they're always loving. They're always giving. They're gonna forgive me. They're gonna help me because they always have before. It's that kind of thing, okay? But I'm telling you. You've gone from the Queen of Cups to the Tiger, okay? <laughs> They're going to see a side of you. Yeah, look, did you see the gnat? Um, somebody's coming to take advantage of you, Cancer. And you're going to show them a side to you that they've never seen before. Didn't we just have that about your person? 
I mean, just show a side of you or side of them. They, yeah, see, they know that. I, I feel like they know that you can give them whatever they want, but you're not going to. You're going to protect yourself. You're going to escape this situation. I feel like that's what you guys are going to choose to do. And you're going to be standing up for yourself. This person's going to be trying to make you feel bad. They're going to lay on a guilt trip, Cancer. Okay, you're going to get guilt tripped in the next five days by somebody who's going to say they need your help really, really bad, but they really freaking don't. They really freaking don't. They just want pizza. They want pizza money or something. They just want to take from you. They want they they think that they can take advantage of you like they have in the past, and they can't. You're gonna be protecting everything that makes you happy here. Yeah, and you're gonna you're gonna tell them to go pound salt. You're gonna tell them no. No way. Yeah, see, they have no idea. Uh, you're going to unleash the tiger in you, Cancer. They don't see this coming, I'm telling you. They do not see this one coming. You're going to unleash the tiger. That's this. That's right. I feel like you are You may just open up on this person um, in the next five days when you find out they're trying to come in and just take you for your money and then guilt trip you. It's going to be very disrespectful, okay? It's going to, yeah, they're going to try to play on your weaknesses, and they think that's love. They, they think your weakness is um, being giving, right? They think your weakness is being loving. They think your weakness is being nurturing. They have no idea that that's a strength, and you're stronger than what they think. And you're not here to save everybody, and you're not here to provide everybody with pizza. You're not. I hope this is making sense. But you're going to be a warrior during this. I'm telling you, that's what the tiger card is all about. Okay? And I feel like you're, you're going to be pretty proud of yourself after this. You're going to realize that you've really changed. You've gone from the Queen of Cups energy to the Queen of Wands energy. Not being messed with. You are not to be messed with, Cancer. Not anymore. Yeah. I feel like that's going to be... Yeah, you're going to send this person away broke. That's what you're going to do. Yeah, no. You've got five pentacles. That's all you need. You don't need my money. That's what Cancer is going to say. You're going to send them away broke. They're going to start in with this guilt tripping crap or remember when or... How could you not help me out and need? Nope. They're going to try to make you possibly feel sad, give you some heartbreaking freaking sob story, you know, about maybe how they followed somebody else out in the cold. It was their fault, you know. They're, yeah, nope. Mm -mm. Yeah, you're going to stop that. No, I don't think so. I don't think so. The divine is going to show you they're going to give you um, all the information that you need intuitively to say no. No, no, no. Got a card that's upside down here. I'm pretty sure it's the lover's card. Yeah. Lovers. Yeah. I feel like you're blocking this person out. That's you saying no, Cancer. See no evil, speak no evil, hear no evil. You don't want to get wrapped up in anything karmic. That's it. You're delivering this truth here and you're moving on. Yeah. All right, Cancer. What else is happening in Cancer's world in the next five days? This person could be a water sign, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, um, really heavy on water. They could be an Aquarius, possibly Gemini as well, maybe, yeah. Yeah, see, it's all about money. They want your money. They want your money. They may even get quite pushy about it, Cancer. 
you're going to stand your ground. We've got two warriors here side by side. This is both your energy. You are standing your ground firm on this person. They do not. Look, here's the thing people don't understand. They're so used to you having that squishy, soft center, right? But that shell is really hard, okay? Yeah, the thing is, is they forget. They, they forget there's more than just the shell and the soft, squishy center. You've got pinchers, too. And you are going to pinch the crap out of this person. I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm telling you. Um, yeah, I feel like you're going to maybe even, you're going to be very empowered here when it comes to this person. Yeah, you're going to protect everything that you created. There's somebody out here, this em emperor energy here, I'm telling you. They wanted to get control of, of the money you've got. Whatever it is you're building. I feel like this is somebody who hates to see you do better than them. You know, and they want a part of it. They're going to end up leaving, feeling burdened, because you're not going to deal with it. Mm -mm. You're going to show them those pinchers this week, tiger. My cancers. They think all, all that you're about is that soft center, right? All gooey and, and mushy on the inside, you know? Yeah, they have no idea. They haven't felt those pinchers yet. Just wait. Just wait. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, see... You know, if they needed help, Cancer, they could go to anybody that they know. The thing is, is you're the only one here that's the most abundant. They're only after, they're after your money. Um, I feel like they thought they could control you and your mind, basically, by giving you guilt trips, um, by playing on your, your loving, nurturing side. It's not going to work. It is not going to work. I feel like this person, you're going to let them have it, Cancer. You're going to let them have it. And they're going to be walking away feeling like a fool. Yep. Even an emperor is no match for this. Uh, a double warrior. Double the warrior here. Yep, walking away. They're going to have to walk away. They're going to have to walk away. Um, this could be your energy, too, walking away because you know this is just going to entrap you. I feel like this is a trap. This, uh, this emperor just uh, wants to take advantage of you. One more time, right? One more time. Let's try to take advantage of cancer. Now, cancer's changed now, okay? Cancer's in control of cancer now. Yeah, I feel like this person's going to play on your emotional side. They're watching you, maybe even adding up your money here. Um, this is somebody who's done a lot of crappy things in the past, and they always refuse to take responsibility for it. They may have projected things on you, Cancer, like those guilt trips that they're going to play on you this week. Um, I feel like you know this person's game, and yeah, they're not, you're not playing anymore. Okay, what else can you show me for Cancer in the next five days? Yeah, see, but it's toxic, Cancer. They're coming towards you. You're in this Queen of Pentacles throne here. Actually... This person may be coming towards you to get money from you and bring it to a toxic individual here. Get money from you or get something from you and take it to this toxic individual. So I feel like this person is with somebody else. They're gonna give you a they're gonna give you an apology here um, or try to talk to you. Or reason with you but there's a fish in this cup I feel like they're bringing it right back to this person that they're chained that they're chained to 
could be dealing with the Capricorn, a Pisces, heavy on Pisces, guys, Aries. Yeah. This person's being watched by the divine. They're under judgment because, you know what, you're a high priestess. I feel like they're going to just be showing you all the red flags during this cancer. Look at, you're, you're just seeing them pop off here, red flag after red flag. Bing, 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 bing. Like, I mean, everything this person says and the way that they act. Like, they're even going to try to defend themselves. This person could get quite pushy with you. Um, they may even, you know, get a bit insulting, disrespectful, just to try to get this money out of you. You're not going to be having it, man. All right, what else can you show me for cancer for this week? Yeah, I feel like this is like, oh, I've got an idea. I'll go to cancer. I'll get the money. I'll get whatever I can from cancer. I'll bring it back here to us. That's what this person is saying. They're just come they're coming to try to get your money, Cancer. All right, what else can you show me here for Cancer in the next 5 days? Yeah. They're missing out. They're going to miss out on this chance. They're they're not getting what they want to come in and get, okay? They're not. Um, let's get some advice for you here. Yeah, so the next five days, Cancer, sometime this week, somebody's going to come in and try to take advantage of you, get you, get your money, and give it to a toxic individual, a toxic friend, toxic partner, a karmic. And I, I feel like you're just, you're not having it, okay? Yeah, look, deep knowing on the bottom of the deck. Here's you jumping out the window, right? Escaping the situation. All right, ooh. I just feel like it's going to be a face-off, and you're going to know it's time to go, Cancer. You're going to know it's time to, you know, it's time to leave this behind, this, this individual. Yeah, you're going to be told here. You're going to have to use your intuition. This could be a friend of yours. It doesn't have to be an ex. It could just be a friend who's dealing with somebody else. Yeah. This could come in with a phone call, too, here. You don't see this coming, Cancer. So this could be even be somebody that you haven't seen for a long, long time. It could even be an ex-friend or a family member, a cousin, something like that. Um, you may have been waiting for a message from this person for a while. This could, even, this could be an ex. It could be an X, but you're, it's going to come kind of out of the blue, and I feel like, um, yeah, I feel like the divine is going to show you it's time to go. It's time to remove yourself from this energy and um, keep it moving forward, right? This is going to be something that, like I said, it's going to be that last straw. Yeah, and I feel like this is a test for you, Cancer. Okay, this is going to be a test. This is something that's faded. Um, yeah, somebody's definitely coming back around to you. I don't know if it's a friend, family member, ex. Take it how it resonates with you. It could be anyone. But they're coming to take advantage of you. They want your money, Cancer. And they want to, grab, they want to get your money, guilt trip it out of you, be pushy with you insult you until you cave and it, nothing's going to work. You're going to let this person have it if they go too far. All right? 
because they just want to bring it back to a pre exist or an already existing toxic relationship. They just want to give it to a karmic individual. So be poised and ready because this is coming in, Cancer. Okay, it's coming in for you this week. This is for someone. Give me one more card. I, I'm just, I keep feeling like I need to pull one more out of my diary deck. Sorry, guys, my battery died. All right, I just want one more very sound piece of advice for you, if I can, Divine. What, one more card for Cancer. One more card for Cancer. One more for Cancer. I feel like this is a test, Cancer. This is like a, a at like an end of the cycle kind of test, right? The gym teacher, yeah. You're going to stand your ground. You're not going to do anything, anything that you don't want to do. Okay, this person I feel is an authority figure, right? That's what the gym teacher was to me. An authority figure. And they may want to make you do something. They may use their authority on you. Like I said, this person may get pushy, very, very pushy. Um, they Very controlling. They could get really huffy with you and like brutish. You know what I mean? Um, and you're going to stand your ground. Okay? You're going to say, go ahead and fail me because I'm never coming to this gym class again. And you're going to freaking mean it. Okay? That is, that's, that's the memory behind that. So, yeah, cancer. And look, used as collateral. This person, you're going to know this person's just coming in to use you. They're only coming in to use you, Cancer. Okay? So this is a warning for somebody. But honestly, Cancer, I think you're going to be great. I think you're going to handle this really well. You're going to be really strong and firm. You're not going to insult or fight with this person. You don't want to fight. But man, if they bring out the warrior, if they bring out the warrior in you, you you will show them a side to you they've never seen before. You're gonna you're gonna surprise this person. Okay, you're gonna really surprise them this week. Anyway, Cancer, that's what I've got for this. Um, definitely a heads up for somebody. Okay, um, I am gonna take this over to the extended because quite frankly. Um, I just want to take a peek into the love side of things for you. So um, if you guys are interested in, in hearing more about that, go ahead and, and join me over at Patreon. There's a link to follow at the bottom of my description box, right? And Cancer, I love you guys. I am so flipping proud of you. You are, gonna, you are going to stand up and be so strong this week, okay? So give yourselves a round of applause, guys. Pat yourself on the back because you're, you're going to do really good and you're going to pass this test. Okay, this is a test. The divine's watching. Okay. Anyway, Cancers, I love you guys. Um, I hope this helps. I hope it resonates with you. Um, if you like this video, click the like button, right? Subscribe to the channel. Help me grow if you haven't already. Um, join this awesome soul tribe, guys, if you like the vibe. And until next time, Cancer, take care of you, my darlings, and peace out.